In this video, I want to show you guys seven chat GPT extensions that can increase your productivity so you can get more done in less time. Time is money, baby. So grab some popcorn and watch all the way through because these tools will turn you into a productivity master. First up, we have web chat GPT, a free Chrome extension that allows users to enhance their chat GPT prompts with relevant results from the web. As we all know, ChatGPT is limited to information before 2021. However, this extension fixes that problem by adding up-to-date web results into ChatGPT prompts, allowing for more accurate answers. So instead of being limited to information before 2021, you can use this tool to access all current internet data, allowing you to access any information, old or new, whenever you want. The best part is that it's super easy to use. Once you download it, all you need to do is turn on the switch that says search on the web, and you could then choose how many results you like, as well as the date and country you want the information from. So overall, this plugin is extremely useful to have if you wanna get the most out of ChatGPT and beyond. So feel free to check it out and let me know if you like it. Next, we have Merlin. This free extension gives you the power to use ChatGPT on any website by hitting Command M. So whenever you're on the web, you can highlight any text, hit Command M, and tell Merlin what you want to do with the highlighted text. You can ask it to summarize the text, make it shorter, rephrase it, create a reply, or anything else you like. For example, I asked it to summarize this ChatGPT article and it did within seconds, which is crazy. I also asked it to write a funny reply to this tweet and it delivered a funny, relevant reply, which I was able to customize to my liking. Essentially, you can use this tool to summarize written content, write Excel formulas, codes, emails, replies, short and long documents, generate content ideas, get answers to all your questions, and much more. Personally, I've been using Merlin these last couple of days to summarize articles quickly and it's increased my my productivity by a lot. So I'll be leaving a link to it and all the other extensions I'll be mentioning to date down in the description for you guys to check out. Next, we have ChatGPT for search engines. If you spend a lot of time looking up information on Google, but get annoyed with ads or websites that have nothing to do with your search, then you're going to really like this one. This extension improves your Google experience by showing you ChatGPT's responses alongside Google results. You can even summon ChatGPT, paste your search results, and then prompt it however you want. For example, I asked it to turn this response into an essay and it did it super fast. What's cool is that in addition to Google, this plugin also works on Bing and DuckDuckGo. So you can use this tool if you use those search engines as well. So instead of switching between tabs, you can get this plugin and access ChatGPT on the go, helping you save a ton of time and allowing you to access the information you need quickly. That way you can focus on creating content or working as opposed to spending hours on research. Next, we have AI PRM for ChatGPT. With this plugin, you can easily get a list of prompts specifically made for ChatGPT covering topics like SEO, marketing, copywriting, and much more. People are essentially adding their best prompts to this list for you to use for research, content, keyword optimization, or any other way. Once you've installed this extension, you'll have access to all these different public prompts which are organized by category for easy searching. As you can see, there's copywriting prompts, marketing prompts, SEO prompts, productivity prompts, and many others. And within each topic, you have the option to choose the prompt that best suits your needs. For example, I chose the topic productivity, the activity plan, and sorted them by top votes, and I got back all these different prompts. I then tried the YouTube title ideas prompt, which creates ranking YouTube titles when you submit your video script or video intro, and it generated 20 different YouTube title ideas within seconds, which was very cool. I mean, since the way you phrase your prompts is a crucial factor in getting the best results on ChatGPT, this extension is a must have. Next, we have ChatGPT Writer for Gmail. This is a free Chrome extension that generates emails and messages using ChatGPT. It's fully integrated with Gmail and generates quick replies and even entire emails within seconds, saving you a ton of mental effort and time. After installing this plugin, you can use it by opening Gmail, clicking Compose, clicking the ChatGPT Writer button, entering the subject of the email, and then clicking the Generate Email button. After that, simply click Insert Generated Response and you can then edit or send the email as is. You can also use this tool to generate personalized email replies based on prompting as you can see on the screen, making it even more useful. All in all, you can use this tool to get way more done, especially if sending emails is something you do frequently. Next, we have YouTube 
summary with ChatGPT. This tool generates transcripts of videos, allowing you to skim through and find what you need much faster. So instead of having to watch a 30 minute video to find specific pieces of information you need, you can use this tool to access the full transcript and get a summary of what was said in the video within seconds. This is one of my favorite extensions at the moment because I can use it to extract information from videos as fast as possible, which I can then use for myself or to create content for my audience. I mean, this tool essentially lets you get all the information you need from a video without having to watch ads or spending a ton of time dissecting a video. After downloading it, it'll show up alongside YouTube videos. And when you open it, it'll give you the video's full transcript, as well as options to summarize it, jump to specific parts of the video, or even copy the full text. So whether you want to stay updated on the latest trends in news, save time, get quick summaries of videos, extract information for content creation, or anything else, this tool can help you save a lot of time and be more productive. Last, we have two ChatGPT extensions that will allow you to unlock ChatGPT on your phone. For WhatsApp users, you can use the tool God in a Box, and if you're an iMessage user, you can use BFF. God in a Box essentially lets you use ChatGPT directly on WhatsApp. So just how you would text friends or family, you can text the ChatGPT bot and get answers to your questions. You can use this tool for free to send up to 10 messages per month, or you can pay to send unlimited messages starting at $9 per month. BFF works the same way, but for iMessage. So essentially, both tools allow you to communicate with ChatGPT on the go from your phone with out needing to go on the web. Now, one thing I want to point out is that BFF is currently in beta mode with a wait list of over 5,000 people. So for now, you guys could only try out God in a Box. And if I'm being honest, these are the only two extensions on the list that I haven't personally tried because I don't really use WhatsApp and the other one is on a waiting list. But I've heard of people using God in a Box and really enjoying it. So give it a try and let me know if you guys like it. So there you have it, peeps. Seven chat GPT extensions to take your productivity to the next level. If you guys want a dedicated video on how any of these tools work, or if you want to learn about other chat GPT extensions and AI tools, please let me know in the comments. If you made it this far into the video, comment chat GPT so I know who my loyal besties are. And if you guys are interested in powerful AI tools, amazing credit card offers, or earning a free $30 with Rakuten, make sure to check out the links down in the description. It'll help my channel out like crazy. I love you guys. Don't forget to share, like, subscribe, and turn on those post notifications so you don't miss out on any future uploads. And if you guys enjoyed today's video, make sure to watch these other ones next. Okay. Bye now.